What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into Carmen Speaks Out After Corey Disturbing Video. Carmen New Boo Big Boogie join live. Let's get it. Corey dropped the video reacting to Carmen's video. According to him, his two hour video was supposed to clear his name. But to be. Uh, before we even get into this, I did react to his video up until the two hour mark. I was gonna finish the rest of it today, but it is on my Patreon link, will be in the pinned comment. I gave a synopsis video about it because, I mean, as we were sitting there reacting, um, Nail deleted the video. <laughs> they brought it back up now, but they deleted the video. So um, I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. I don't have time to play with Neb right now, Carmen, and nobody else. Okay, so I'm putting it on my Patreon. I'm giving a synopsis, uh, synopsis on here. If y'all want to tap in, link is in a pinned comment. I went thoroughly into it, sat there for seven hours, reacted to this shit. So yeah, there you go. Be honest, I'm more confused now after watching the video than ever. It was a lot of parts in there I was expecting him to thoroughly explain exactly what happened. You found out in the studio that she cheated and then what? He kept saying that they put hands on each other and that it was a physical altercation. No, explain exactly the full story of what happened. Every time it got to the parts where she was talking about he put hands on her, he just kept saying that she was lying. She he was never miserable. told his point of view of exactly she what- She didn't even look like herself right there. But hands on her. He just kept saying that she was lying. He never told. She was miserable with this nigga, bro. Oh, his point of view of exactly what happened. He kept bringing up his friend Boosie because Boosie was living with them for a short period of time. And he claimed during that time when that situation happened, Boosie was living with them. But we didn't hear nothing from Boosie. We didn't hear no receipts. We you got cameras all around the house. Where was the footage? It was a few receipts here and there. I think Carmen mentioned something about the baby's birthday and how he was kicking them out on the baby's birthday and they didn't actually go somewhere. He came with a video showing that he did take the baby out for his birthday. Okay, we got that. I felt like the most receipts he had was for Michi. It was a birthday thing. It was like, what are we doing? Like, why are we doing? <laughs> Yo, first of all, bro, why are you filming me talk about my side, nigga, to put in your video? I would never trust this nigga. I mean, she already couldn't trust him anyway, but you know, women love to just try and steal, give a chance, give a chance, give a chance. But bro, knowing he could have used that. But it's given, she already told him. It probably ain't nothing she ain't already tell him. And then he seems like he understood what I said. And they say, no, he took the pose down. He said, my point, he said, I'm sorry. And I didn't mean to do that. Like, I, I'm not trying to cop in and drama in your life. Like, I'm not doing this. So she was aggravated with Michi because Michi's over here posting the fact that, um, well, basically showing proof that they physically did anything with each other. And like, bro. Why are you posting it? You already know I got a whole lot going on, da da da, and you over here posting this now. So, you know, she was kind of having a back and forth with both of them. Both of y'all relax. You know what I'm saying? Is where I feel like Carmen was. Posting it, and it's just like, see, I just didn't, I just don't want to get on his motions, honestly. Because he feels like I'm his girlfriend. I'm not his girlfriend. And this is something that we talk about. And I don't know how much I can stress about it. He claimed that Carmen was in on the whole Jennifer situation and how she knew about Jennifer the whole time. Yeah. And how he knew about Michi. And they were supposed to be like a character in their storyline to yeah. juice up the story. And he doesn't understand why Carmen is upset about Jennifer. He talked about the assistant and how Carmen wanted the assistant to be around. I wanted him to clear up what he said on that live when he made it seem like him, Carmen, and the assistant did something together. Like, it was so much stuff I wanted answered that was just, like, skipped over. And also, Corey kept contradicting himself because he said Carmen's mom forced them to get married so Carmen could stay in the country. But then later on in the video, when Carmen was going off and saying, don't mention my mom, he said that Carmen's mom didn't force him to do anything and that he barely talked to her mom. So which one is it? Did and she he barely talked to her mom because she doesn't speak English. So how could she genuinely convince you to do something and she can't even speak, you know, full English. Well, hello. And, and she can't even speak full English. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, ain't that much convincing going on if I can't even fully 
speak English. I got to think about speaking English and convincing you to marry my daughter, bro. Shut up. <laughs> or you or you didn't communicate. I'm so confused. And let's really think about this. Corey's mom don't even give me the type of mom where you about to force her son to do it anything she might not be correcting him when he's wrong but she definitely don't look like the parent that's gonna sit back and allow you to force her kid to do anything there's no. so many pieces that's missing from this story that just it was just pointless to me if i'm a person that's fighting for my life and i'm trying to clear my name i'm coming with bank statements ring video footage video footage text <laughs> messages the assistant everything. Boosie, everybody would have been in this video because what he was just basically saying that she was lying and that was not what i was expecting from a man that says that he got a lot of receipts but that's just my point of view y'all leave your comments down below let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to that last night Carmen team tried to remove Corey video due to Carmen being in the video but it is back up the link to that video is down below if you want to watch it Carmen did go live and she also dropped a video right after Corey dropped his video I don't know if Corey has a YouTube rep or not he did go live last night but I didn't watch it I don't know if he has a YouTube rep or not but you could definitely beat copyright like even if they were to copyright me I could beat it I just don't feel like it this ain't the month. I just moved. This ain't the time. <laughs> so I ain't even gonna play that game. Yo, like, so the link to that video is down below. That's the only thing I worry about was my best friend. Who the best friend was, y'all? <coughs> 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 See what's on y'all face? <coughs> so, no. It was definitely not me. <coughs> Child, please. Yeah, y'all keep telling me to ask somebody if I'm trying to ask somebody and if it's not working, it's not on me. Oh. Hey. <laughs> See now you did he say anything? You don't have service. Uh, oh, there you go. You hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Well, Wait, so you talking me. you talking your shit? <laughs> I, not really. Not really just giving people feedback on the sound. Oh, okay. I just wanted to check on you, that's all. <laughs> Oh, damn! <laughs> Boy, when a woman look at a nigga outside of you, make you want to throw up. Oh, I'm, I'm, about you, I'm, about, I'm about you wait. My, my phone need, my phone need the ring. I'm about you wait. <laughs> All right, I'll see you later. All right. <laughs> I'm talking about ear to ear, smiling, nervous. Ah! Getting people feedback on the sound. Oh, okay. I just wanted to check on you, that's all. <laughs> I'm, I'm, what are you I'm, doing? I'm about, you, I'm, about, I'm about you wait. My, my phone need, my phone need the ring. I'm about you wait. <laughs> all right, I'll see you later. All right. <laughs> how the hell Carmen meet Big Buggy? <laughs> like, how how did that happen? Did y'all pass each other and be like, God damn, shout out what your name is? Or did he DM you and slide and DM because he knew Corey was a piece of shit, so he was like, What's up? You know, like, how did this happen? I want to know. That's all y'all wanted to see, right? Duh. Of course. <laughs> Where's my all y'all talking about? Let me get serious. Let me get serious because y'all know how y'all like to, you know, run with things. Um, <laughs> I was supposed to be, went live, and I was supposed to be talk about part two, but... They told me that I can't talk about it too much unless we have everything done. And we're having, like, a lot going on with that song. Y'all don't understand. Yeah, I just wanted to give y'all an update. The, the video, the music video is coming. And You Made Diddy Look Like an Angel Part 2 of the song is coming as well. Pair uh, as gonna be well. Amazing. Like, I don't know about y'all, but every time I play that song to now, like, I get, like, freaking chills in my body like like it's my first, first time all, the girl sung that song especially her runs and the part it needed to run <laughs> for real for real all along but all so tell me how y'all feel right because there's a lot of people that are making <laughs> like dance to it the song and they're like oh this is good but then when they hear the song are sensitive about it and they be getting like like the people they do it get backlash or they get like negative comments because they be like this is something that Carmen really went through like y'all should even make fun of it but I don't think it's 
fun. Like, I don't think they make it, like, fun of me. I just, I love to see that it gives them, like, a different... Some people understand what entertainment is. That's why some of y'all mad that I'm reacting to Tea Room and you thinking that her... <laughs> Her message on the screen when she says don't put my content on other platforms other than youtube it's talking about me it shit ain't as serious as y'all think it is but i have a report with t room i have a report with so real t i have a report with voice for the people that's what happens when you keep a good rapport with the people that you need to keep a good rapport with okay but um nigga Entertainment is literally that, okay? It's literally that. So I, I don't understand. Some way to listen to the song if that makes sense. Like I don't take it as same person singing part two. Oh yes, like good. she has she to did finish a good telling job. my story. Like she has to tell my story. She did a good when job. When I write down my story, she has to be able to tell my story. The nigga said, uh, she she didn't write the music, but said I always tried to help her with her music. But she didn't write it. So what happened? You know what I'm saying? Like, what? And she connects with the song because she been through something, like, similar to what, I, to what I went through. So, like, when she heard the song and when she, like, made like made the song, she put all her emotions to it. So it was more <laughs> like, oh, like, it was just perfect. Like, the perfect girl for it and everything. Because I feel like due to the fact that she went through something like that, she was able to like to really feel the song and really see where I was coming from without just looking at it like, no, nah, that's too much or I can't do that because whatever, whatever. You know what I mean? I was waiting for this moment. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, the song, me. first of all, giving, giving. All right, y'all. <clears throat> this girl did uplift her. I'm going to let y'all watch it. <laughs> um... For one, I've been following y'all for a long time. Way mm -hmm. back when y'all was way back with King them and all in the house, Ari and all them. Ari said the wrong way. But right. when I tell you the song is absolutely great. Great. I hate the opinions that people are giving out on everything, but everybody, that's what it comes with. Opinions. Right. Yes, it right. does. But you're doing your thing. I'm a mother of four. Okay. I had my first when I was 16. I got four. I got four kids. I've been married. I've dealt with a whole bunch. And when I say I haven't been, I haven't dealt with the hands being put on me. But, 12, 12 in the chat. But I have been dealt with uh, verbal abuse, mental. It's all the same. It's the same. And also, I want to say just to every every female out here that's ridiculing you on this song or about how many times you go back and all this. Let's cut that, y'all. Because y'all know we all going back sometimes for less. We got men in the house that don't even work. That people will roll back for. Okay. So I just really had to put that there because I'm like, it's a lot of people out here trying to down you, but I know a lot of people that have to take, run back to somebody for less. Mm. They don't have it. You know what I'm saying? Or like you said, that's your that's your husband. You wanted your family. You got some people out here that they man stand right here with them with their kids and they gotta ask them to babysit their kids. And they don't got a job. You know, mm -hmm. but I love, love the song. I like the first one you dropped. I like this one. Mm -hmm. I don't care if it wasn't you seen, you wrote it, it's yours. And keep doing on you boo and 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 i'm loving it the haircut you coming out i can see it i even commented on your first video when you dropped it i said i can see it i can, I can yeah i love that haircut i like queen's haircut on too uh haircut on her too I see everything i can see the confidence <clears throat> coming back i can see you coming back and that's what we need keep on dropping your videos keep making them have something to say because baby guess what good or bad good or bad what people say gonna keep you relevant anyway you just gotta know how to keep that hard shell on and i know Thanks. you got the hard shell now because of what you have been through don't let nobody break through your shell again. Stand ten toes for your kids. I don't care how good you of a person you are or, or you know, how positive you try to be or whatever. People going to find a negative in it. And that's okay because that's what their job is. My job is to put out content, talk about it, you know, dissect it, whatever the case may be. And your job is to dissect me. You know what I'm saying? So after I realized that, yeah, I just got all up out of my feelings. I don't even give a fuck anymore. <laughs> We all got a job to play here. And you're going to be straight, baby. You're going to be straight. So I'm going to get off of here because I don't want to hold up your time. But I'm on your stuff and I'm watching. And I'm going to watch you blossom and do great like you're supposed to be doing. Hey, no, thank you. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you. Like, you're you welcome. You. So you're much. welcome. I'm going to let you all here, but I'm waiting on that part too, baby. Uh, don't be waiting.
Okay, I promise you, it's, it's, it's worth waiting. I promise you. I, I bet it is, and I'm waiting. So, congratulations. All right. And also, before we go, I do want to thank all your 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 team, your family. I seen the video earlier. I seen the video earlier that you posted. You need friends like that around you. You yes, need you friends, and, and never close off the ones that's there. You know what I'm saying? No matter if you think you're gonna get judged or not, your friends are gonna always be there. Your real friends. So mm -hmm. always remember that. And blood don't make family. That's mm -hmm. a fact. I'm yeah, out of here. Blood may be thicker than water, but your friends is your water. You understand what I'm saying? I had to learn that the hard way when I was growing up. But anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey.